everybody, welcome back to Food Reviews with Fatty. As always, I am Jay, aka Fatty. Um, so today we're going to be doing a review of something that I've wanted to do for a little while now. Um, and I kind of just hesitated at first because it was something that at first I don't think I would really like, per se. Uh, but I decided to get it anyway. Uh, this is going to be the Popeye's Blackened Chicken Sandwich. Um, now this is a piece of blackened chicken. Um, it comes on the sandwich, and it comes with a mayo and pickles, it looks like. Um, this is basically just one of their new extra sandwiches that they just started doing a little while back. So this is a slightly new uh, sandwich here. Um, as far as the sandwich goes, uh, you can see here, this would be the chicken sandwich, the black and chicken sandwich, as they call it. It's got the mayo, and it's got the pickles, and overall, I mean, it looks like a pretty decent sandwich. The girl did say that they are making it fresh for me, whatever that means. Um, so, if that means something bad, please let me know in the comments below, and I'll never order from Popeyes again. Uh, but it almost sounded like it was a double entendre. So, you know, when you tell somebody, "Oh, I'll make it specially fresh for you." then it just makes you feel a little odd. So, uh, first things first, we're gonna go ahead and cut it right down the middle. Cause I, I choose to do this in order to show you the textures that are involved in this sandwich. Um, if any texture at all, uh, for the most part, it's kind of, I don't know, that at first look, it doesn't really look like anything super spectacular, really. There you go, take a look at that. Yeah, it looks all right. Uh, now, looks can be deceiving. I don't know because I don't eat a whole lot of Popeyes. Um, nothing toward the restaurant in general. The girl was really nice. Um, this would be the Park Boulevard location in Pinellas Park, Florida, that I went to. Um, as far as this goes, I'm going to go ahead and say that I should like this sandwich. Have, should it not be spicy because that's why I really don't eat Popeyes very often is just the spice I, I'm not a hot person really so uh, you know kind of bear with me on that one because that is something that I have an issue with myself personally so uh, without further ado let's give her a little nice run I'm just gonna leave everything the way it is pickles and all So the mayo and pickle seems to go together pretty good. Um, I'm still not sure so much about the the chicken. I'm gonna try to attempt to take a bite, just the chicken by itself first. Hmm. Yeah, the blackened chicken has this kind of odd texture to it you know probably pr I'm gonna say like a highly processed but highly flavorful chicken patty the mayo not so much because I'm not a big mayo guy if I eat anything that's like mayonnaise based it's gonna be like a light miracle whip uh, just because of the heavy content of sugar that goes into most of these so um, that would be definitely something that could be considered uh, you might want to ask for light mayo because this has a lot of mayonnaise on it um, the pickle and the mayo blend together pretty good with the sandwich but this is like a science that's been perfected years ago I believe this is how they like to make sandwiches in the 50s or something like that. A long time ago, it started with mayo and and pickle on a chicken sandwich, and that's been a thing that's been around for a long time. So this is not reinventing the wheel. Um, it's just a matter of how good the chicken is, really. 
Um, because that's what really sets every chicken sandwich apart is the flavorful part of it. Um, with this sandwich, if I wanted to compare to like maybe Chick fil A and McDonald's, I will say that with McDonald's, this is better than McDonald's chicken ever could be, in my opinion. However, if you put this up against a Chick fil A sandwich now, especially the grilled chicken sandwich. It would be no candle in the wind. Um, however, let me try it one more time. Mm. 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 Okay. So this is going to be pretty easy to make this decision. Once I got a good bite with everything on it, just now, I have to say, it's a lot, a lot better than I thought it was going to be. Um, very, very flavorful. Um, that actually hit really well. Now, I have done a couple other reviews of Popeyes in the past. And I'm going to be really honest, um, the last two things, the strawberry biscuit was a miss, Oreo cheesecake was a hit, that's obvious, Oreo cheesecake is always going to be a hit. Um, so this is kind of like a tiebreaker here in the general, of the three things that I've reviewed so far from Popeyes. Um, this one in specific, I'm going to say that... This is definitely, definitely going to help the tiebreaker for Popeyes. Uh, this is definitely a thumbs up. The chicken tastes really good. It feels really filling for what it is, and, and the chicken doesn't sit like completely, a pro it doesn't feel like a processed product, even if it is. Um, that's the one thing that I'd like to point out. And it's really, it, it's just a lot better than what you would normally expect from a restaurant like Popeyes because they strictly do chicken. Um, this here, it's a chicken sandwich. Not much complexity in that, but being as that it's one of their new ones, there was a lot to be expected. And I'll have to say that they met the quota on that expectation of how good this sandwich would be. Um, yeah. I feel like this is actually something really well. And you know, for $5, a $5 chicken sandwich is a $5 chicken sandwich. Um, you get what you pay for, but I mean, it's definitely really tasty. So, this will end my food review of the blackened chicken sandwich. Uh, please do look in the description below to take a look at the J-Pump music, as well as the food reviews with fatty merchandise. Uh, please do also go ahead and take a look at my Patreon. Um, we are accepting all donations to help the channel out in any way, shape, or form. Please do hit like and subscribe um, and hit the notification bell. Also, keep, them, uh, keep a lookout for some of the videos I'm going to be doing, like the uh, Don Poncho Chicken Quesadillas Express Meal. Um, I've got a few other things in the works. Uh, I've got a new one coming up tomorrow, actually. So keep a lookout sometime between 10.30 and noon. Um, that will be coming out immediately. Uh, if it doesn't come up on this video, it'll come up on the next one. Um, or one of the future videos. Um, if there are any ideas that you have of foods that you would like me for me to review... Uh, please do put a comment in the below and let me know whatever you guys would like me to try within reason. Um, no $100 meals, but within reason I'll try and review my honest opinion of whatever you like. Because for this channel to thrive, it's all about you. So, with that being said, this is the Food Reviews with Fatty food review and fatty out